It was the night before the end of the dawning, almost 7 o'clock p.m. 8 o'clock, it's the reset, and the dawning is gone. Goodbye, Sparrow Racing League. Goodbye, Treasures of the Dawning. What is going on, world? Welcome back once again. My name is Zach Novak, and this... Well, this is Zach Novak Plays Games. In today's video, I'm actually at the tower. I am in my awesome set of, uh, well, not the full set, actually. The awesome set of the uh, Treasures of the Dawning armor. However, this set isn't complete. For my Huntress, I am missing the chest plate. So, in today's video, what do we have? We have 10. I repeat, 10 Treasures of the Dawning. So, we've already rolled the intros. I know that was different. Usually intros are like blah, 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 tell you what's going on. Then intros, but different styles because it's 2017. Trying out different things in the videos like this. So, well, this isn't that different, but you'll notice by the editing that it definitely is different. So, let us start things off with the first Treasures of the Dawning. What do we receive? Well, we got Addendum. That actually, what's that for? Well, that's for the last word. Do I have a last word on me? No, I do not. Oh, well, that sucks. But that was one package. Let's go with another package. We'll go down to seven, and then we'll see if those seven that I have left can actually get my Titan full set. Fingers crossed. See how we go. The Warlock, that's definitely already complete. We get the Scarlight Grasps for the Huntress. Okay, that, uh, that kind of sucks. Let us just go to the Postmaster, stand right next to the Postmaster lady. Good old robot, can't remember her name. I don't know why I cannot remember her name any times. Robot lady, have you got anything? Nope, nothing. Okay, so we have one more to go for the Huntress, then we're switching over to the Hunter. Nope, we're switching over to the Titan. We got the vest, holy shit, thank you phone. I needed that, my phone just gave me good luck. See, bad YouTuber with his phone off, phone on gets the stuff he needs so that's pretty freaking cool i like that that is hype that is the full set of snow angel gear i like that let us go to the titan and see what we can get all righty so we are on my titan now i do have to say being a bad youtuber and uh letting my phone go is one thing but there was a video that was supposed to go up last night of how to actually cheese omnigul with your titan that video should be going up sometime tonight after this one, hopefully if things actually work out. Let's see how we go. We're on a Titan. We haven't got any of the treasures of the Dawning Gear whatsoever. I actually still have my uh, Thrall butt helmet on from a while back. I love this thing. Never getting rid of it. Uh, yeah, it's pretty freaking cool. But something I just want to say about that video is suppressor grenades. That is the key to everything in uh, the Omnigal Strike. So just keep that in mind. But we're in the Titan. Let us just pick up this orb and let it go because I like doing that. And honestly, I'm going to miss this when the dawning is gone. I'm going to miss all the snow, all this prettiness, that freaking giant snowflake type thing up there. It looks like a diamond. I don't actually know what that is, but it's freaking cool. As you can see, it starts changing and shit. But... We're here. We are not queer. We are actually going with a Radiant Treasure. First off, because I have a spare Radiant Treasure, let's see what we can get. Something good. We got Meteorite. What is Meteorite? That is... Well, that's for the Nemesis Star. I didn't actually know the Nemesis Star had something cool. I haven't got that on. God damn it. Bad YouTuber. However, we're here. Treasures of the Dawning. Can we get the full set for my Titan? We get the Graves of Lamentation. Lamentation. That's that's a different one. Okay. Well, let's get the second one. We get Nano Hands. That is for the Icebreaker. Yes, that's the Icebreaker. Knew that one. I still haven't got the Icebreaker. Chasing it. And yeah. Horrible hunting season. However, Treasures of Dawning. This is what we need. Give us the set. That plate of Lamentation. That is not any of the treasures of the dawning gear so far well it is secondary set but not the cool set there we go lantern horns and lava bird that's pretty freaking cool let's chuck the horns on first just because they actually look really freaking cool it reminds me of a vex like very much so vex like it's cool it's very very freaking cool we also got the lava bird sparrow what does that look like okay 
that's that's different it's a perfect machine as they say however we don't actually it doesn't change any of the vehicles so we've got three left what can we get from the final three come on give us a chest we got ragabone now that is for bad juju let's have a look at that no that's the black spindle ragabone for the black spindle pretty freaking cool ah two left what can we get we got rose of acid for the thorn that i like that rose of acid actually looks really really freaking cool i'm hyped about that let us actually just pop a fell winter souvenir see if that could possibly maybe help us out with this final package what do we get come on give us the chest for the titan all i want is a chest dawning chest give it to me we got the lantern greaves well we got the boots that's not the worst it's not the best but uh yeah sounds they actually aren't too bad they are unique but uh they're not exactly what i'm chasing you know Let's have a look at these the gold ones uh not so much gold with this shader on oh well let's go back to these just because i like them they match the dune marches look awesome we got the chest plate the plate of lamentation what does that look like you rejoice your enemies lament Oh, lamentation. Oh god. I didn't actually I couldn't work what that what that was. It was lamentation. It means like when your enemies are upset because you are winning. That's cool. I like that. I'm keeping that just because of the blurb. That's cool. We didn't get actually anything else unless there is possibly something at the postmaster. Maybe some gauntlets considering we're full. Walking into walls there. Let's see. What do we have? We got two sets of of boots from the uh, nightfall packages that we did I didn't actually see those from before okay that kind of sucks well it's infusion fuel you also got another plate of lamentation oh well that's cool we get we went through those packages we got a few actual cool things let us just go down quickly to uh, the uh, hangar let us just go down quickly to the uh, vanguard area have a look at those weapons and see what the actual uh you know and see what the actual ornaments look like on said weapons so we go with first the nemesis star what do we have we've got meteorite that that's okay paint's kind of wearing off very different i kind of really like silver bullet quite a bit more just because it's solid black it looks like it's been used for years thousands of years i love that thing it's freaking cool we also have the thorn where is the thorn it is it is the beast that i have lost and cannot find in here there it is god damn it i'm blind so first off we've got rose of acid which that is one that looks pretty freaking unique it kind of reminds me of a hive wizard type thing i guess like a hive bane weapon i guess well it's a hive bane weapon of course because it deals a lot of damage and it's freaking cool but it's also got Rose of Corruption, which this I actually have on a thorn that I already have in the vault somewhere. I love this. The green, the animated green is honestly hype. The only other weapon that is in the game that has an actual animated kind of animation, I guess, is the Telesto. When you go to the Telesto and you look at Lingering Vestige, it, it actually is animated. It's cool. So that is two weapons in the game that look freaking hype. Oh my god. What else do we have? We got the black spindle. Let's see what it actually looks like. The ragabone. That is this yeah, it's the purple one. That's like the full hive knight style. I like that. That is really freaking cool. We've also got the cold between the stars, which I think I have in the vault somewhere. Makes it the full taken style weapon. Which is kind of cool. Not the greatest, but uh yeah, we've already got a taken sword, that's why I say it's not the greatest, but it's still freaking cool nonetheless. And I wish I could show you the, uh, the icebreaker, but, uh, I haven't discovered it as of yet, so that freaking sucks. However, that is still something that I'm actually really hyped for because, you know, it makes Nightfalls more fun to run, especially if you're doing it solo, it just, it feels awesome. Going through two-manning it is also a really awesome feeling. I went through and ran it with Bob yesterday. I'll get a little screenshot on the... There you go. That's both of us there. Pretty freaking cool. We're doing the Omnigul strike. We won. Omnigul was destroyed. 
and I'll have the video up later of how to cheese Omnigool. But until then, this has been Zach Novak. This is my Titan with some horns and an ice thing on his head that if you stop, just stops raining snow, which I, I honestly think that's pretty freaking cool. You start moving and it snows. That's hype. Alrighty, so hopefully you guys have enjoyed this different video. Hopefully you enjoyed this style of editing. I'm recording this very much live with my Titan. Wave Titan, good boy. Let's terrify people. Let's dance. Now let's sit down just because we can. So we are here. We are on my Titan. We went through, opened up a bunch of treasures of the dawning packages. Tell me what you think about those packages, whether they're just a waste of money or really what they are. I do have to say I was given a couple of them from a friend, a very reliable, not so reliable, partially reliable friend. So that's pretty freaking cool. I was hyped with that. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video. Once again, this has been Zach Novak. Do all that good stuff down below and I'll be cheering like Kieran if he was Ed Sheeran. But until next time, share this video around. It seriously helps out the channel, helps me out, helps you guys out because you can see more of my content. I blabbered through that bit because I don't want to say, hey, you know what? Take your time out of the day and share my video. Everyone needs to see this. No, no, not everyone needs to see this. Only people that are actually interested in this kind of shit need to see it. So, hopefully you have enjoyed this fun shit today. I certainly did myself. I am enjoying doing this video so far. Hopefully I enjoy the editing, but I am blabbering. Do all that good stuff once again. This is Zach Novak, signing off. Until next time, peace out.